I'm Malachi Watson as Lesniak. I'm a retired footy player, Tongan international, and now business owner. I played footy my whole life, pretty much. I got to represent Tonga, the Tigers, and Panthers, and I guess every time I put that jersey on, I was always grateful to be able to put those jerseys on. I guess doing the hard yards, sacrificing, uh, putting in the hard work to actually make it, gave me a, a really, really big understanding of how proud I was to be able to put those jerseys on and represent my culture and also the rich heritage that uh, those two clubs have. So it's definitely an honor and I'm definitely proud that I was able to do that. Kind of bittersweet, I guess. I wasn't planning on retiring at the start of the year. Uh, my body had other plans for me and unfortunately I did have to retire, but I was lucky enough that we started a business two years ago and it's finally at the place now where it's able to take up my time and I'm able to concentrate and I guess put my time and effort into the business and transfer it from footy uh, into the business life. I've been grateful to be able to take the field with Dow playing with them and against them. Being able to take that off the field into the business and being able to grow something outside of footy has definitely been something that Dow and I have been proud of. We have a great legacy within footy with our great grandfather Steve being you know, the first Kiwi captain or the first Māori to captain the Kiwi. So being able to have that passed on to Dow and I and be able to do that on the field in first grade and then to now bring our legacy and forge them into our watches and our timepieces is definitely something that uh, we're very, very proud of and something that drives us to be able to you know, make a big impact off the field. Uh, it's definitely very hard to achieve work-life balance. It's very, very important that you do find that balance because I could work 14 hours plus on the business and I enjoy that. Um, but I also got two little kids and a wife, so being able to manage that and give them the best upbringing is definitely a challenge, but I make sure that I'm able to allocate time towards them. I've had plenty of ups and downs and definitely plenty of downs. What people don't realize is that when you are trying to make footy, it can come as easy as debut at 17 or it can come as hard as you know, what I had to experience and debut at 25. So definitely had a longer road, definitely a lot of challenges, a lot of ups and downs, but that resilience has built me into, I guess, the person I am today. And when I get setbacks now in business, you know, I've learned and I've gone through, I guess, a bit more harder challenges through footy and it's made, um, I guess, the challenges in business not seem so hard. So, um, you know, I've been grateful for my journey. I wouldn't change it any other way. I love the lessons I've learned trying to make it into first grade and, it, you know, I'm forever grateful for that. I've been able to experience that and build up a resilient to it and uh, been able to, to apply it in my life with my family and also into, into our business. EIWS, I guess they're a super fund that they manage your investment, you're growing your retirement fund in a way. And I guess I never realized how important retirement funds are until obviously I had to retire at the start of the year. And it's really made me think about the long term when I do retire at 65, am I going to be looked after financially? I guess EIWS does that and they take the headache off you not having to worry about or stress about your retirement and be able to survive once you do.